Hey, Brian here from quantlabs.net. You're looking at a, ooh, I always want to do that, all these cool effects here. This is an iPad. Okay, um, cool, I, iPad's cool. Android, no good. Okay, anyways, doesn't matter. MATLAB Mobile, the app on an iPad. Woo, I wish I'd give you better resolution, but courtesy of a really, really crappy iPad, uh, Android phone were connected into my computer and off she goes calculating some stuff here uh, we're just waiting while it's connecting it's doing its thing this is all connected through a Wi-Fi so it is not uh, I'm still curious to see how well, first of all, let me let me explain on the server end. This is my server um, on the uh, laptop, which is an i3. I'm using a very old i3. It's only maybe two years old, so it's slow. Um, so give it some uh, patience there. But you can see that uh, we're getting responses from the computer of my MATLAB session. That's the current MATLAB I'm using. So that current version <coughs> is killing the system. But if I do something like uh, B equals, I don't know, 12, okay? It's no different than as if you're on the, um, uh, on the iPad. But here you go. You can see it says B equals 12. So let me just type in B just to do the value. Uh, there you go. So you can see it's... 12. Simple stuff like that, but the MATLAB mobile is working. Um, you know, if it's on a better processor, it'd be a lot more responsive, but it is working on my home desktop. The install is fairly straightforward. Um, obviously, you got to worry about networking issues like uh, firewall and all that sort of stuff. So uh, it does work. I'm really happy. So now I can sit in the bar and uh, research models uh, in bars on beaches in the summer and get quote unquote creative with trading models uh, with my PhD that I do not have. So there you go. Hope you enjoyed it.